With this video, we are reaching the finish line, the end of the Conversational AI Assistance with Calm course. I really hope that this video series gave you a better understanding of how Calm operates and how the combination of strict business logic and the flexibility of LLMs empowers you to build better and more efficient enterprise-grade assistance much faster and much easier. Throughout this course, we covered all of the key components of Calm. We looked into how we can define business logic, how we can add components like LLM power dialogue understanding and more advanced features like enterprise search. I hope that this course also gave you a better understanding of how you can build conversational AI assistance with Calm in practice. I hope that by now you know how you can get started, how you can configure your development environment and continue building your assistant by implementing flows, adding the necessary LLM powered components, and most importantly, how you can run your assistant in a production environment. This is the end for this course, but it's definitely not the end for your learning journey because there is so much more that you can learn about Calm and conversational AI assistance. I would highly recommend you spending more time going through the documentation of Calm because it has all of the relevant information about all of the parameters and customizations that you can make when building your assistant. Calm documentation also comes with a number of follow along guides that can be really useful when implementing specific components of your assistant. And it doesn't end here. You should also check out Russell's blog to find more tutorials and interesting articles about Calm and conversational AI field. And most importantly, you can get technical support on Russell's developer forum. So thank you so much for embarking on this learning journey with me. And I can't wait to see the next wave of efficient and really powerful enterprise-grade assistance built with Calm. Music